Hi, hello. I am Oliver Johannesson. I'm here to talk about something very important today. It's the war that is waged between feelings and data. And I am here to remind you that in any kind of battle between feelings and data, feelings always win. Always. Allow me to remind you why. Because feelings, they're the most important part of the human experience. If we think that we feel the, the happiness, the excitement, the love, the fear, the jealousy, the anger, that is unassailable, okay? That is how I feel. You cannot tell me that is not how I feel. Only I know whether or not I feel like that. Therefore, that is the only data point that matters. God, it sometimes just angers me so much thinking about all the people that are still arguing about this. It's unbelievable. Sometimes they say things like, uh, but, but Oliver, what about, uh, what about the scientific method or cause and effect or, um, you know, uh, Action and reaction. Shouldn't we be uh, trying to steer the world uh, into some state that we want it to be? But isn't that unscientific? But no, it is not unscientific. Allow me to explain, okay? Just listen, is what you would tell them. You say this. You say, uh, have you heard of um, Charles McDarwin's Origin of Species? Yeah, um, so... That's where evolution came from, and basically that's when we all learned that the strongest survive, okay? It's nature. It's natural. And just as natural as my feelings are, if we have a disagreement, well, then it's your feelings versus my feelings, and then our feelings have a battle. That's how that works. It's nature, okay? It's, there's nothing unscientific about it, okay? And sometimes they just keep pushing it. They're like, oh, cause and effect, blah, 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 science. Well, you know what? You just tell them, you keep pushing it, buddy. I'm going to cause my foot to affect up your ass.